Hey guys, uh, this is Kakarot VG. Welcome to Mob Creatures Mod Spotlight! This is going to be my first Mod Spotlight, and afterwards I'm going to put up a tutorial of how to install this. So, yeah, so, um, you can't really see anything right now. Options, video settings. Uh, Turn my render distance to normal, and yeah, and it's not me for a hundred percent. Huh? Huh. So let's run around. So ah, uh, I'm not in creative mode. Dang, 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 dang. No, 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 no. Game oh, all right. So uh, just a second, guys. Alright, there you go. So, let's fly around and see what we have here. So, as you already guessed, these are sharks, I believe. Might be dolphins. I. I can't really tell. The volume seems to be. Uh acting weird right now. Or no one's just making the sound. Okay then. Oh, uh, you know what? It's like this forge has to load and stuff. There we go. Now we're getting some sound here. So, there's the stupid annoying bugs. And stuff. Yes, this guy doesn't want to make the sounds. Alright. So, yeah, it adds in. So, basically, Mo Creatures is a mod that, for Minecraft that adds in so many new animals, it's just ridiculous. But it, the thing is, it doesn't just add animals, it adds in some ah. items and stuff too. As you can, yeah, you, just, you probably just heard that crow. Let's go to spawn eggs. See what we have. So let's see. We have a. Where are they? No, 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 no. Also not, no, not yet. No. All right, here we go. So see, we have the bunny, the snake, the turtle, bird, um, mouse. Turkey, horse, horse mob, ogre. Alright, guys, we are back. So, let's get back and get the spawn eggs. Um, fire ogre, cave ogre, boar, bear, duck, big cat, deer, w wolf, wraith. All right, put these in here. I I probably should have prepared for you guys, but uh, oh well. Wraith, flame wraith, cave over, or spawn fox, werewolf, shark, dolphin, fishy. Kitty, rat, scorpion, right, scorpion, and crocodile, ray, jellyfish, goat, ostrich, bee, 
nine. Yeah, guys, sorry if this is a rather long tutorial. It's just, there's just so much to show. And there's cricket, snail, butterfly, golem, elephant, motor dragon, bird. Um, moto dragon, elephant, and golem. We'll get those. All right. So, I'm sure in the background you probably heard uh, a couple of animals. It, it, it kind of doesn't really matter, but whatever. So, yeah. So, um, here's the. Crocodiles probably spawn near the water since they're so fun. Whoa, crocodile! Yeah, in Minecraft. All right, so spawn a ray. There's your ray. Uh, be careful with rays. They are extremely poisonous. They are very poisonous. So are the jellyfish. Now. Spawn in a goat. Okay then. Um. Oh, and be careful of goats. They will eat your items. They're like living garbage cans. They're like living garbage cans. So, yeah. Here's a golem. Here's what happens if you attack the golem. See, he's starting to suck in some. Stuff and the textures are referring to the original, of course. This, cause um, the texture doesn't read for monsters apparently. Did you shoot leaves? All right, all right. So here's the Komodo dragon. I, I guess they kind of can't live on land, maybe. I don't know. So now, let's head somewhere a bit more flat. Get the elephant. This seems like a good place. Here's the elephant. That's loud. That's, that's loud. So, yeah, so here's the elephant, guys. And here's a Fox. Now I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna show you guys the weaver later because they're just so boss. All right, so now let's get some more of these mobs. All right, so now spawn the ogre. Ah! Here's what happens if you attack the ogre. See, he starts uh griefing the land. It's just, yeah, I actually had a problem with this in one of my houses in Modern Survival. It was. It was just a big pain in the butt. So, yeah, and here's a skip. No, stairs Ah! Here's a turkey. You just killed a turkey, you idiot! Ah! Mouse. There's a bunch of different variants of them. And here's a couple birds. Um. Yeah, I want to get away from the. Well, um, apparently I just got a bird, so I guess that's nice. Now, here's what you can do with a bird. Well, you can tame a bird with, uh, seeds, and they will let you, you can put them on your head, and you'll be able to glide along the ground and stuff, and you won't die. Here's a turtle. Turtles can be tamed with reeds, and... If you happen to tame name a turtle after one of the ninja turtles, he'll actually start to look like a, he'll actually look like a ninja turtle. So now here's a bunny. It's bunny over a head let's name it Jim. It's Jim! It's Jim! Uh also about uh bunnies, be careful, they will breed like crazy and it will get really laggy after a while. Let's spawn some snakes. Here's a snake. If you kill a snake, sometimes they'll drop an egg. You can use that egg to make a snake, and you can name the snake, and you'll have a pet snake. So, yeah, that's 
those mobs. And let's get some more. So next up we have the wolf. This thing is kind of OP and will do its best to kill you. So now let's get this. That's the that's a flame that's a wraith, I guess. Deer. So here's a deer. Here's a deer. So deer are um Yeah, there's a deer. Uh so here's the uh, big cat, and here's a couple of bears, and I know that um, Diction loves beers, loves bears. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, so if you guys know, uh, uh, know eat my Diction one, then let him, then show him this. It's Oh, they're killing each other. <laughs> Alright, so. Here's a duck. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't. Hold on, I, I'm gonna show you something. This, this, is my, this is one of my favorite things to do. It's my favorite thing. It's my favorite thing to do with more creatures. Oh, I do. I want to see that duck. Gotta hit it with the shovel. Hit that duck with the shovel, shovel. Hit that duck with the shovel, shovel. <laughs> All right, so um, now boar. Let's get a. That's what a boar looks like. Huh? Come on, the dragon. All right, all right. Fire ogre. This thing will actually set stuff on fire. So, be careful with that guy. Now, let's get to the next set. Alright, so, should be down to our last set. Flame Wraith. This is a Flame Wraith. They, uh, they will light stuff up. It's, it's really weird. Uh, rat. These things will try to kill you. They are evil. No! Chat! So these are fish. You can actually make a fishbowl and get an obtained fish and get a fishbowl. So yeah, it's pretty neat. So here's the difference between a shark and a dolphin. They, they look the same but they're different. I I don't know how. Uh, it's kind of hard. Fox. Bunch of foxes. Uh, again, flame rays. Alright. Um. Oh wait, scorpion. So yeah, here's the scorpion. See, some of them actually have baby scorpions on their back, and that is, that is how you get a pet scorpion. Okay. So yeah. Let's get rid of these. What's left? So, cave over and fire plant. Alright, so... This is what cave over is. So, a flame over actually drops fire occasionally, and the cave over would tend to drop diamonds. So, be careful with these guys. Um, ogres will be revamped and look different in the next update of this. So, just to clarify for you guys, these are fireflies. They um, they like to light things up. Now, let's get something. So, this is the Weaver and Portal staff. All this stuffs from the even world. So now let's right click with this portal staff. And where are we going? Um, where are we going? Ooh. Ooh. What's this? Ooh. Ooh I've never been here before. Seriously though, I actually haven't really been here before. I'm, I'm used to playing 1.4.7. So I actually haven't really gotten the chance to really explore this place. Hold on, I need the um options. Uh where's the portal mod options? No, that's not it. 
options. There it is. Global mod options. Uh. Alright. Be right back, guys. I think my Minecraft just crashed. So. Alright, hey guys, welcome back. Uh, apparently there's a bug with the uh, global mod options, and my game crashed, it, it, and I got it failed to update to an event screen. That seems to happen to me quite a bit. I think it might be hitting my computer. Right here, let's just spawn in a bunch of these. And gives ourselves a saddle and watch the saddle on this guy they keep me off just keep trying uh uh gonna be mine weaver you be mine no bad bad weaver you bad weaver your mind. Come on. Come on. Come on, Weaver. You you need to become mine. You're gonna become my Weaver. Do I need to like feed you something? Come on! 
No, we burn. Seriously, I've tamed the weaver before. What the heck? You know what? Screw you. I'm gone. Alright, guys. So, that's the mod spotlight. And that is basically my creatures. Um. Uh, no, you guys didn't see the werewolf. Alright, let's find the werewolf then. And boom! Werewolf! Run! No! No! Alright guys, this is my creatures. Uh, now for the mod tutorial. See you there! Hey guys, welcome back. So now for the installation part of the tutorial. Okay, so first off, this should this isn't too much different than doing Windows. So if you're using Windows, then it's essentially the same thing, just slight difference. Um, if you're using Linux, I can't help you. I'm I'm sorry, but uh, I just I can't help you. Okay, so first off, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to look look up Minecraft Forge. This is for 1.5.1. So, if you're using 1.4.7, essentially it's the same thing, just you gotta download the 1.4.7 thing. Minecraft Forge. Alright, so, now go to Minecraft Forge Downloads. So, it goes to file, files.minecraftforge.net. So, what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna download the recommended one. And if you download the latest version, that's okay, but it's best to go with the recommended. Alright, so. And then wait till it's done. Skip and all right. So Minecraft Forge. All right. So next up, uh, we're gonna want to locate more creatures. More creatures. So yeah. So this is this. Um. Yeah, my internet isn't it's not too great, but it is decent, it's decent. Okay. Um So yeah, alright, so now so there should be stuff down here. It's five point oh eight. So what you're gonna wanna do is you're going to want to click that and it'll bring you to the download page. Um, now download more creatures should take you to media fire. Wow, that looks pretty weird, All right? So, uh, yeah. Oh, my mouse is stupid. All right. Now, so that's more creatures. So what other files are needed, you're going to need to get a GUI API. And you're going to want to get custom spawn, custom mob spawn. Two, one. Alright. So download that. And now it should be good. Wait a minute. Dang it. Farm. Downloads. Spawner. G Y E P I. More creatures. All right. So that's all. That's the files you need. So now what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to open up Finder if you're on a Mac. Go to your Minecraft and go to your bin. Now I'm going to want to open up Minecraft Jar with either the Archiver or my personal favorite and the much faster version. Just rename it to Minecraft.jar.zip. Unzip it. And it should only take a couple seconds. And you can do whatever you want with the .zip. I personally, I usually just move it to trash. Alright, so now, now that that's open, what we're going to want to do, um, if you're on Windows, you can just open it up with uh, WinRAR or with 7-zip, it, it doesn't really matter. 
So now we'll go to Minecraft Forge, select everything in here, and copy it. Which on Mac is Command C, and on Windows is Control C. So now paste it, which is Command B on Mac and Control V on Windows. And oh, to select it all, it's Command A and Control C and Control A. You guys can tell that. All right. So now that Minecraft is like that, so now we'll launch Minecraft and let's make sure it works if it doesn't work then there's something wrong um you don't have to uh... delete meta inf i just i just never do you don't really have to it doesn't really matter uh... it should load in any second now so see i have three mods active so these are minecraft coder pack forge mod loader minecraft forge all these come with forge i started with a um, Fresh my cups jar, so all of these come with forge. Alright, now now there should be something in here named config core mods and mods. Alright, let, let me move this real quick. Mods by myself. Okay. So core mods. Uh you're gonna wanna drag GUI API into core mods. That you can just get rid of, and then in uh, mods, you're gonna want to drag in custom mob spot. You're gonna want to drag in custom mod spawner and Doctor Darts. Or my, if you, or you can always just zip them up, which is what I usually do. It saves space. Or my favorite, if you want to combine them both together, which isn't that hard actually. All uh, to do is drag custom spawner into the doctor's art folder here and drag custom spawner dot java into here and that should be it for custom spawner move that trash and that should be it so let's launch minecraft log in let's see And as you can see, uh, we have all the mods loaded. So, see you guys next time. Uh, bye.